You may recognize this filming location from our behind the scenes video with the Choker team. Today I'm about to play another match, this time against one of the top streamers and my frenemy from our online chess battles, Alexandra Botez. Alex, how are you feeling about today's match? Hi, Anna. Thanks for challenging me. I'm really excited. You taught me the rules last time and now we finally get to play. I'm looking forward to it and I hope to have better luck at Choker than in our sub battles. I hope for the opposite, but we'll see how it goes. <laughs> I'm going to send you a friendly challenge and we all know that it's not really friendly. It can be friendly and competitive. I think that's fair. That's the right attitude, but I'll try my best to beat Alex this time. She has more experience in the poker phase, um, so I think I should be very smart, especially at the beginning with betting. Well, there's always beginner's luck, Anna, so even if you're not as familiar with poker, we'll see how it goes. Thank you for the my trash talking, Alex. I didn't expect anything else from you. <laughs> The match is just about to start and I've got the white pieces. All right. I'm happy about that. I'll be playing black this time. That's okay. You could use any advantage you get. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. I've got a really good starting hand. It's so good that I'm going to go and call. Okay. I'll, I'll go easy on you for now. I'll, I'll give you a simple check. Simple check. Hmm. I think together with the third and fourth cards that I received, I should be happy about this game. Um, it's looking promising. All right, then I bet 400 if it's looking so promising <laughs> for you. Let's see how you play. You're not buying my bluff, are you? We'll see. Mm, I'm really curious about your cards because... My ones, well, I'm going to check. I'm going to check if we are just as lucky in the first well, game. Well, when you check, you're showing me that you don't have anything because this is your last chance to try to get money from me. So if you want to play, you're going to have to pay. Here you go. You're reading me way too well, Alex. Thank you I'm for raising the bet. The pot. Only the pot, Anna. <laughs> you're only betting the pot. Now I really need to decide whether I'm going to go and trust these cards or fold. I'll trust them, but I'm not sure I should be trusting them. Placement I get to go phase. first. Okay. I'll start with my favorite opening, placing a pawn on f3 or d3 for protection of the king. And just to remember now peace and see where I want to put it, right? Indeed, and you choose the order in which you want to reveal your cards. The pawns can go from the 7th to the 5th rank for black and the pieces on the back rank and the 7th. Right. I'm going to place my knight over here. Okay. And I'm hoping that Alex has many pawns and minor pieces because then I will get So the pieces good are chance. on the 7th. Oh, it's designed yeah. actually because it shows you that. I'm just being defensive, you know, Anna? Hmm. Yes, still three more cards. I'm wondering what pieces will they be. I'm gonna go and place hmm my wait a second, what piece do I wanna reveal? The order is so important because uh I'm hoping that you will have a hanging piece that I can capture on the first move if I'm smart enough. Now let's see. Pawn here. I think that's a solid structure. Well, you're very smart to to remind me of this. <laughs> I'm very competitive, right? Yeah, very competitive, Anna. Here, I'm <laughs> just going to place my... Okay, that makes sense. Two more pieces for each. Now, if I start attacking your pieces, you will defend them, but I will still hope that you don't have the possibility to defend everything properly. So I'm placing my bishop on h2 to attack the knight. You're being tricky as usual. I'll protect it. Okay. Now, you have a rook, but I also have one. And I'm praying that your last piece is not a heavy piece. A 
a rook or a queen that will protect the c7 knight and win the game for Alex if she has a heavy piece. What's your final card, Alex? You're about to find out, but I need to create some suspense, Anna. <laughs> okay, <laughs> creating suspense. <laughs> Dramatic music. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's a cute way for me to do this, or if I just have to be, you know, careful about it. <laughs> You're kidding me. Alex is a queen up. <laughs> I was hoping that your final piece would be a pawn or a minor piece. Then I have a chance. Which would make but sense. In this case, right? I would save my last placement to be a pawn because that sounds like <laughs> really good strategy. Never would have guessed that one. Well, a girl can still dream, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm completely lost, but I'm going to go ahead and make a few moves because who would want to resign or move one? That's what I should do, I think. But I'm not going to go for it just yet. Improving my Well, knife. you are the stronger chess player, so I have to be careful. You're very sneaky. Do you think I can be sneaky enough with a queen uh, down? You know, if someone can, you can. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Actually, I had a queen up against Hikaru, but he had a rook for it, and he saved the game. He built the fortress. Oh, okay. I believe that. Oh, what am I going to do? I don't even see tricks. Like on the d6 square, I could create a fork, but the pawn is protecting the d6 square. So I don't have any tactics here. Alex, will you play your trademark Botus Gambits? Just to help me a little bit. Game. I'm getting out, out of the oh. pin. I'm playing nice slow chess and then my 3.6k pot. You know, that, that's all I want here. Okay. I'm going to try and escape with my king, but this position is hopeless i'm afraid well i'll i'll offer you a very friendly trade here you know just just a rook saying hello oh yeah at least you'll get one of my pieces off the board which really feels like progress for you in this position <laughs> thanks alex i appreciate it i'm just trying to be a supporting friend here <laughs> you're always very supportive i think this game is going to end shortly but before i go down i'm gonna go ahead I was going to say, I'm going to go ahead and improve my bishop, but now I'm seeing that I don't really have an active square for it. I'm moving it to g3. Okay. I'm going to activate. I'm just following in your footsteps, activating my pieces here. I see. Well, I wish I could keep the knight on the board, but I don't really have an active square for it, so I'm trading it for your knight. There we go. Oh, the check is unpleasant. I'm trying to move away from it but this defense won't last for long oh so unpleasant i'm gonna protect the pawn with the king but i think alex will go for the kill definitely. now definitely it uh, almost looks like you might flag here yeah i could flag but i think i will take the noble decision of resigning when i'm completely lost and i'm about to be mated good game oh, alex thanks anna you did very well with the betting, realizing that I was just bluffing and I had a very average hand. But I was also lucky. I had a pretty decent hand. I had one of my pawns promoted to a rook, but that's just about it. Got it. Um, okay. Now you will get the white pieces. Okay, perfect. So I get to have the white pieces this time. Yeah, I'm hoping for better cards. Better. Fair luck. enough. And my first two cards are really good. You told me that last time, though. <laughs> I always say it. I think it's my catchphrase, and it doesn't mean a thing usually. <laughs> but this time, Alex, this time, I have really good cards. Okay. You believe me? Um, unclear. I'll, I'll believe you based on how you play next, Anna. Okay, I'll need to bet if I want to equal your chips because you are way ahead of me. So I need to raise the stakes here. Well, if you are bet, you know, 10 times the pot here and I just have <laughs> a bad hand and I'm playing against an international master, then the correct thing to do here is to fold. Will you fold? I fold it. I mean, I'm... You believe in me? I had a bad hand as well. Okay. Shall I tell you my cards? Yeah, what were your cards? 
a queen and two rooks. Oh, that's great. And a knight. That's the best I fold know. of my life. Why did you fold? I had two pawns, a knight and you a had rook. Two pawns. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking I good. I think I gave it away. I gave it away too quickly because I raised too much. I should have raised slightly, but not this much. Right. I was too aggressive, I guess. A, a little too aggressive. I think so. Yeah. You want me to nibble a little bit. And if you're going to ask me to <sighs> pay that much, then. I need to improve on the poker phase. It can be seen that I don't have much experience in betting. Here we go. I'll, I'll, I'll raise half the pot here. Half the pot. So that could mean that you have a good starting hand, but you don't want to scare me away from the game. I just explained, so it would make sense. <laughs> How are you going to follow up on that raise? I'm curious. Um, well, you should bet more than you check, so I'll bet the pot this time. Just not trying to scare you off here. Mm -hmm. Smart lady. I'm going to go and uh, call it. Okay. No raises from Anna yet. I'm scared. I'm scared of your strategy. <laughs> Is this a good hand? Hmm. I'm going to check. <sighs> What's your move, Ms. I'm Potters? just going to continue doing what I've been doing and betting the pot here. Otherwise, if you fold and I get to take... You've already put a lot of money in the pot, so I'm happy to just steal it. Hmm. Um, I think I'm curious what you have, so I'm going to go for the game. See, they've had a good hand. This time, we'll see how it went. Okay, I'm starting with my usual opening. Okay. And I'm hoping that you have more pawns this time than heavy pieces. That's that's a very logical hope you have there. <laughs> Wait a second, you're starting with a knight as your first piece. Are you telling me you don't have a single pawn? Or I'm just playing 4D chess. I'm not sure, <laughs> Anna. Oh no, this is looking not promising if she doesn't have a single pawn. Ah, <sighs> Alex, <laughs> following up with another piece. <laughs> Alex, just you know, we chess. talked about this. <laughs> we talked about this, that you shouldn't crush me publicly. You know, I'm going down to nail. I have no choice, Anna. Well, you did for the previous one, so that no, I you, take you as... You uh, did get a, a winning theory. hand, so I think that yeah. was good. Good progress yeah. on your part. Thanks. <laughs> I'm very proud of that one victory. <laughs> Protecting my back rank with the rook because Alex was going to attack me with rook c1. It could have led to me. That makes sense. <gasps> A queen and you still have one more card? I'll let you, you guess what my last one. And another queen? Alex? Ding, ding, ding. ding. And I'm <laughs> giving you, you know, information rights here. So you can use that information when placing your next piece. And maybe you'll save the game. I can't believe it. You're telling me in advance that your final card is a queen and I have nothing to do with it because my final piece is just a humble rook. Well, you don't have to put the rook down like that, humble rook. You know, the rook's doing its best. Here we go. You really have a queen. I'm not... Alex. Alex... From the first game where I thought I'm going to get crushed immediately because you were a queen up. Now you have two queens up. Well, this is a game no. that I should resign immediately. I have to resign, Alex. Two queens, that's way too much. Yeah. I Thank you, you for the games, <laughs> Alex. I, I had to. I have absolutely no chance against Alex. Like already the queen up in the first game was too much. I thought I'll just play a few moves, but two queens? You got very lucky with the cards, lady. I really did. I just got good hands here. I think that's what happened. Well, I will just consider that second game as the main one. That should be fair. Just forget <laughs> the chess part of it. You won the second one. And that's what matters. <laughs> No, but even in the second one, as you told me, I was too aggressive with the betting. I raised too much, so that gave away that I actually had yeah, good cards. Yeah, you scared me off there. 
Mm. And in the third one, do you think I should have folded at some point? Because, well, you were raising very mildly. I didn't know well, if didn't you think, actually had you, such strong hands. I mean, you didn't have any queen, but you did have two rooks. Um... Yeah, it felt like a good hand, but you had two queens, so nothing can nothing can counter True. that. True. I mean, I, I wouldn't have been raising like that without at least two rooks, I feel like. So you could have known that I at least have what you have. Hmm. Um, since I was betting the entire time and increasing the bets. But I guess it, it depended if on... on No, I guess because we put a bet on the last card as well, on the fifth card, right? Yes. You know, I think you just wanted to play the chess game, Anna. I think you were like, I, you know what, forget the cards. I'm going to beat her and whatever amount of queen she wants, I'll still win. So I get your logic there. You didn't play the boat as Gambit. I'm a little disappointed. No, I got lucky that time. <sighs> Thank you so much for the match. You have won this one, but I'm going to challenge you for a rematch. I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully they'll go the same way. You could get the mm. small, the small pots, you know, and 200 chips and I'll take the big ones. It seems fair. Thank you. Thank you. Um, do you think that now that you have played against me, will it get you to play more choker games? I really like choker. I find it very fun. As you know, I like chess and poker, so I'll definitely be challenging more. I'm glad to hear that. As, as I said, I'm going for the rematch because I cannot let this happen. You are beating me at every single game that exists in the world. Well, you still are beating me at chess most of the time. Mm, not in bullets. In bullets, I would need to improve. But our sub battles, that's really a bittersweet taste. Every Sunday. <laughs> I hope to see you soon with our sub battles on Sundays, Alex, and for the rematch that you're promising to me to give me a chance and try to have better luck with my cards. No, that sounds good. Maybe one day we'll even have a choker sub battle and see who wins that one. That's a great idea. I think we should do that one day on Twitch. Thank you so much for the match again, Alex, and see you for the rematch. Sounds good. Bye, Anna. Bye.